Come rain, come sunshine was a major statement of the five busy adults two years ago when they dedicated themselves to rigorous training on the scriptures. Associate degree in theology was conferred on three of them. One associate degree in ministry and missions was for the other two. For the challenges ahead, not to catch them unaware, it is imperative to acknowledge that a balanced knowledge for the stability of our society is based on home training, educational training, and religion moral training, which is the word of God. The pulpit needs the word of God more than ever before. And one of the mandate of the ministry is to educate every Christian on the knowledge of the word of God and its interpretation for life application. And they are going out as ambassadors of Christ to teach and bring the knowledge of God to everyone that God will send their way. Enough of the doctrine of men. We need to go back to the Bible. Understanding the principle of the world of the ministry is fundamental for the 2022 class to excel as salvation is built on the gospel of Christ. In Christendom, in the, in the work of the ministry, there is a way the system runs. There is a principle by which you do the work of the ministry. You don't just do it. For example, you go for evangelism. There is a way you evangelize. You preach to people. There is a way you preach to people. So you don't, go, you don't just jump into it. You must, you must have the required training. You must have the required training for you to be able to do it the right way. I will make sure that I spread what I learned so far from the School of Ministry of Crystal Light International to deliver people from bondage. Being an affiliate of the University of Family Bible, Maryland, USA, Crystal Light Ministry Institute International is a multicultural denominational organization established to prepare and train men and women of God for manifold ministries in Christ, the church, and global community to go into the world and make disciples of nations. In Oshobo, Joshua Ogochide, NTA News.